everyone and welcome back to another Midnight's Legacy episode. So today we're starting off with a Mortimer who is our newest ex-boyfriend, um, slash ex-fiance, and a baby daddy, calling us to ask if he should spend some casual friend time with someone. I, you know, I wouldn't do that if I were you, Morty, because you are kind of a bad person. I don't want you corrupting anyone else. Um, it looks like we've got a welcome wagon outside. Uh, some people have come to greet us to San Sequoia. Um, it looks like it's just our neighbors. I kind of want to invite them in, but I'm also kind of, like, busy because I'm hungry. Um, I would have Chelsea do it, but she's socially awkward, so I don't think she's going to want to invite all these people in. So maybe just do a cheerful introduction to all of our neighbors and let them come in and we'll try the fruit cake just to be polite and um hopefully the baby won't get upset because if the baby gets upset then we'll have to go upstairs and take care of um our newest little baby um but yeah let's go ahead and greet everyone hopefully that'll let them come inside oh are you pregnant Oh wow, okay. Honka Thori. Um I didn't realize that someone from San Koi was gonna be pregnant already. Uh it looks like are you about outlook on life? Okay, don't do that. Maybe just in, come on in, you know. I'm I'm hungry, I've got a newborn baby. I really don't have time to be standing up for talking. Okay, so she gets along well with the elder sim. It looks like she also gets along well with the Bernice, but not Ian, so that's a little weird. Um, but yeah, we 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 definitely got some stuff going on this episode. Uh, things are going okay for Chelsea. She's just writing, and she's published a book already, and get gone a little bit into her aspiration. She actually needs to be leaving for work. You can finish that book when you get home, honey. Um, so yeah, she's just going to do that, and I checked at their work schedules, and it looks like um they have mostly different days. Like, most of the time, Lavender's off, Chelsea will be off, except for Mondays and Fridays. So, hopefully, we can get, um, Chelsea promoted or Lavender promoted. Um, so we won't have to worry about it. Why are you- What? So you're eating my food? What- What are you doing? The welcome wagon is over, yet you're eating my food? This Miko's frenzy. What? What? Okay, this is so weird. I've never had that happen before. Why are you guys still here? Um. Okay, this is really odd. I'm just gonna maybe. I was gonna say I was gonna ignore it, but. Um, actually, hang on a sec. What if I chatted with our neighbors and I told some jokes? To build comedy skill. What about a knock knock joke to you, and then a knock knock joke to you, and then maybe like a joke about fashion to the old guy. You know? mob. Dub my blood. But that would be funny. <laughs> Try to tell some jokes so like the mood would be cute. Uh, I'm just gonna put the fruitcake in the kitchen for now, uh, cause no one else is in the living room, so I'm just gonna Shut put him. it in there and let uh, uh, Bernice finish eating her piece. Uh, okay, don't- why- uh, is everybody crying again? Oh no. She is like always hungry. I think today is actually her birthday, um, which is good in a way. But I also don't want to age her up with all these people here. Um. So, I'm just kind of like. As soon as they leave on this, I'm going to put that fruitcake in the sink. Because my Sims hate fruitcake. They just they absolutely hate it. And I just know Lavender's not going to like it either. So, yeah. I'm just going to throw it away, honestly. And then. Oh, yeah, right. You need to. Uh, you need to plant all of your little things. I bought her some stuff to go in her vertical planter boxes. Um, because I was hoping maybe she could get some gardening skill. I know that's not like a requirement or anything, but I just thought, you know, maybe it's something she could pick up. 
while well, she's just waiting to age up to being an adult, she's still got 14 days left uh, before she's an adult. So it's gonna it's gonna be a while, you know, before we complete this generation. But that's that's fine. Um, I'm not I'm not in any rush because she's gotta she's gotta complete some skills. She's got the piano skill mastered, but I found out she has to have the comedy skill as well. And I was honestly focusing more on guitar and charisma because for some reason I thought she had to get level 10 charisma. But it turns out it's level 10 comedy. And she has to get level 10 guitar to get to the top of her um, career. So that's kind of um, just a little bit stressful. Uh, what? Why did the part? Oh, that's just the plan. Okay, that's weird. Um, are those people still downstairs? Wrong. They are. Uh, That's kind of good. Um, maybe go be. Maybe as the field baby compliment <laughs> outfit. That's good. Um, maybe just tell her another knock knock joke. She seemed to like the first one. Silly behavior impersonating a celebrity. Um, yes. Maybe. Tell a joke about fashion. Mm -hmm. Just kind of chat her up. I'm just gonna fast forward through some of this because, yeah. Um, let's see. You know, no. Is this helping her build her comedy skill? Oh, it is. Okay. Why don't you go to the bathroom and I'll go tell some of my jokes to Ian because Ian doesn't like me very much, so I can tell him a few jokes. And maybe that'll make him like me more. Uh, where is jokes? I clicked on the wrong tab. Okay, um, joke about politicians. I keep clicking on friendly. I, I, this dialogue menu is like really. It's really messing me up lately. Um, let me just sit down there. I don't like that she's getting playful, cause I have a bad history with some dying for being hysterical, but... Okay, so she's gonna head home, um... It looks like, okay. These, these two aren't, so maybe we could keep telling jokes, um, because I really want to level up in our comedy skill, and this looks like it's working more than the um the comedic stand we've got over there um so maybe if we just keep telling Ninja. jokes yes, <laughs> that'll be okay um Chelsea will get back uh from work <laughs> until <laughs> seven so these two okay. should be gone by the time that they come home okay 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 <laughs> Um, dirty diaper alert. We're gonna do dirty diaper, uh, a little feed, and then maybe a rock and the cuddle. And is today her birthday? Yes, it is. I don't know why her icon looks so much different from what she actually looks like. I, I'm not quite sure on that. Dance but yeah, let's go ahead Garza. and take care of the baby. Um, oh, we're so close to level six. If they just stay, we could... Wait. What we're so close to? Oh, yeah, we are close to level six. Okay. Um, so if we could just get level six of the comedy skill, that would be so good. So these people just need to stay around. And then we can tell some more jokes. Oh, she got level... She got level four parenting. She's actually doing pretty good on the parenting. Um, I'm actually trying to do one of these other aspirations, the super parent one, because I thought, you know, she probably, now that she's a mom, um, she'll have some parental desires, so I thought maybe that would be fun for us to do, um, since she's already completed her aspiration. Um, so, yeah. Okay, so it's Cherry's birthday, she was born apparently at four. Okay, so share some baby pictures. And then maybe just keep telling this guy jokes. I mean, he doesn't really like us that much. I don't know if Ian's just hard to get along with or if it's something we've done. But maybe we could just try to 
telling him some jokes. Um. Sarb Samzo. Wait, wait. like the one about engineers. Inja, Inja. Uh, a little joke about body. Yeah. A funny story. Uh, a um, little joke about fashion. Okay, level six. Okay. Okay, she's gotten too very playful again. Okay, now she's playful. Um, let's check her levels real quick. Okay, I think... This guy can probably go home. <laughs> oh. That way Lavender <laughs> can practice her guitar alone. Um. Mm -hmm. Maybe she will just pluck some inspiration. Yeah. I think that'll be something we do. We might go ahead and get level 10 charisma, honestly, because we're so close. And it would give us some, some good helpful boost. Um. At some point, I do want to add. We need to add the baby mobile. Do we have time to do that before? Uh, I don't know if we do. Maybe Chelsea should do it when she gets home. And then Lavender could play with the baby a little bit. Um, okay. Oh, Chelsea got promoted. She's a vlogger now. Okay. She got. Given a word processor? Oh, okay. Um, oh, where can I place this? It's kind of, it's kind of big. Um, like, huh, where, where would this, because we don't really have a desk in the house, because like this was going to be my office. I ended up turning it into Chelsea's room. Um, and this is the kids room, so, mm, okay, we're gonna have to sell that, but it did make us some money. Uh, how about, well, first of all, get changed out of that. Wait. Okay. Okay, well, that's not ruined, so eat that sandwich. And we'll go ahead and change you into, wait. Please don't tell me we're out of food. Oh my gosh, we are. We're like out of food. Okay. Um, after this, you go ahead and go to the bathroom. And I'm just gonna real quick change you back into your everyday wear. Um, because yeah. And then upgrade out of even mobile birds, and we're gonna need to give we're gonna need to ease up, uh, the baby. Okay, put the rattle back down on the floor where I had it. Yeah, and invite Simon in. He said they brought something over for us, which, honestly, I don't mind, because, like, we, we kind of need stuff. Um, but I do kind of, like, what's going on? Like, why is he, why is he over here? He was just over here last night. Um... So let's go ahead and wash that up. She's feeling okay. Uh, throw her away. Wait. Oh, there's a diaper. Okay. I'll take care of it, honey. Um. Okay. Receive the gift. Real quick. And then feed the baby. Uh, and then t just give, give me one second, Simon. Give me, give me one, one sec. Just need to feed the baby. Chelsea, are you doing okay on adding the baby mobile? Because we're going to need that for tonight. Um, because Lavender needs some sleep. She's got work in the morning. Or tomorrow afternoon, rather. And, yeah, she needs to get done. Um, Simon, just give me one second. And then I want, I want the present. Um, so if you could just give me one second. I've got to put the baby down. Okay. Okay, I am ready for my present. If you would like to give it to me. Maybe, maybe a little flatter. No. Maybe if we flatter him, he'll be like, oh yeah, this is, this is the gift. Like, thank you so much for... 
giving me ah. a gift. Okay, handy a skill. Ah. Okay, she's got that on the box. Okay. Raid. Reel her in. Why don't you do that? And uh, maybe that'll give you some fun. Because I think you are a bookworm. Oh, no, you're not a bookworm. Hmm. Well, it'll still give you some fun, just not the big bones. Okay, are you gonna. Are you gonna give me my present? <laughs> um. Some. Okay. Uh, did he give it to me? I just didn't notice. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Oh, he gave it to Chelsea. I guess. You knew Lavender needed to go eat. It's kind of weird. Um, so yeah, you take care of that. Um, maybe you send him home. Maybe be like, uh, look, it's kind of late. Card to Violin, 425. Do I want to sell that or do I want to keep it? I feel like she has a lot of instruments, so maybe she would want to keep it. Um, but like at the same time, do I? Do I want to keep it? <laughs> like 425 simoleons is a lot of me love. Um, how about we run upstairs and use the bathroom? And then let's age up this baby so we don't forget. Uh, do, 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 do. age up. Okay, Chelsea, how are you doing, honey? Okay. So it turns out she can't write, uh, resume writing her book because she's got a creative fog and she's starting to burn out. So I don't want her to do that. Um, maybe she should stop reading her book and go ahead and go to sleep for the night, you know? Sleep off that, uh, that creative fog. And let's see, play the piano or schedule a date. Okay. Yeah, that's not going to be happening because I don't really want to get into another relationship where we're just going to have to end. And you're not old enough to meet your life partner yet, so. Oh, oh, oh. I, want, I want the full screen here. Okay, I am oh, kind of ready. Okay, I'm ready. Okay, oh. Okay, we are ready. So, Ch Cherry is going to be sensitive that is a purple trait so i guess we are working with the brand so sensitive she is prone to diaper rash often picking bits of food and can more easily become overstimulated by too much play and social interaction however she also rests more peacefully through the night when soothed i mean it's not as bad as intense for sure um let's try to get a screenshot of her oh she's so cute um, so you go ahead and flip to the ground there. Oh, she already smiled. That's so cute. Um, uh, let's go ahead and put Cherry in bed. I know she's not... Okay, wait. Don't do that. Um, she needs to be fed. <laughs> so, maybe feed her first? Uh... Where's the feeding? Do, do, do. Yeah, do a quick feed. And then put her to bed. Because she's she's quite tired. Um, but she needs to be fed more. Aww. So do that and then put her to bed. And then we'll play... We'll play Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Maybe that'll help her sleep. And yeah, let's see. Is she, is she doing okay? Okay. Um, she's actually not that, not that bad. Like, for Mortimer's child, she's honestly not that bad looking. Um, oh my gosh, Mortimer's riding at the same place that Chelsea is. Is he stalking us? Like, legit, I just want to know. Is he stalking us? Because it kind of feels like he is. I mean, like, he's, now he's working at the same place as like our roommate like <sighs> it's getting a little weird Morty it's getting a little weird 
Um, definitely gonna sell this bassinet, I think, because if we have another kid, um, I'm probably gonna want to use a different bassinet. So, let's do that. And then do a little... Oh, right. I also want to soothe. To sleep. Um. Okay, is that... Is that working? Let me, let me see if I can get a screenshot of this. I'm trying so hard. Um, I don't know if this is going to help her fall asleep or if it's going to make things worse, but I'm genuinely trying. Uh, let's go ahead and sell that. And this is going to be our new bassinet. So I'm just going to keep it in our inventory for now, probably. Um, yeah. And then, are you trying to go to me? Oh, she's just already out with light. Okay. Oh, I really love to sleep by a lullaby. That's so cute. Okay, well, it looks like everyone's gonna go to sleep. Hopefully, Cherry sleeps through the night. Um, even though she doesn't, I'm probably gonna give her a makeover in the morning and let you guys see that. Um, so I'll be back in a minute. Alright, so let's go ahead and give Cherry a little makeover. So up close, she looks like this. She's really cute. She's got some kind of curled hair, high eyebrows. Um, I think the high eyebrows is probably kill some morty, but I could be wrong. Um, so I'm gonna try to find some purple outfits, I think, because lavender is still very much dressing her at the stage, so I feel like she'd dress her in lavender. And um, also, another thing is, oh my gosh, these are so cute. Um, we also need to decide if she's going to have any more kids, slash if Cherry's going to be a contender for Maroon Engine. So, we need to go ahead and have a look-sees at some of these colors. Okay, I think definitely full body uh, is going to be the move. Um, this is super cute, honestly. I think I'm going to go with that. Uh... And then as for this, probably white slippers, uh, and then probably no socks. I mean, those pants are pretty long. Uh, and then, oh, for funny, I don't really like either of those options. I'm gonna be real. Um, maybe maybe the shirt, and then we go with the nice blue pant. Because I don't really like the purple polka dots. So, maybe we go with blue. And then we put her in some nice little, like, purple <laughs> shoes. So that's cute. Uh, and then, obviously, we're going to have to do some purple full body looks for her different sleepwear attires. I always give my infants a couple sleepwears. Just because, I mean, they're so cute. And they're mostly always in their sleepwear. So... Let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go with this kind of like full body, like a little purple dress thing for her party wear, which we'll probably never see, to be honest, except maybe, maybe if we have a birthday party for her. But I honestly don't see it happening. So we'll just put her in this. I think it's pretty cute. Um, hot weather wear. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I did. Did I use this already? I don't think I did. No, I didn't. Because it wasn't a sleepwear option, right? Yeah, so let's go ahead and use this because this is really cute. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and use that and some little white sneakers. And then cold on the rare. I mean, I've got to use this. But also, I need to use something else. Uh, maybe. A little purple hoodie and I mean the bunnies are cute but it doesn't really go with the elephant how one could say it's the elephant of the room <laughs> you know I had to do that um and then yeah well obviously this little right sneakers will probably be fine so these are all of her little looks I honestly think I'm gonna keep the birthmark um one because I don't have kind of thoughtful edit mode turned on and then two, just because I think it's cute, and I'll probably only keep it for her infancy. Um, I'll probably remove it after that, but I think it's cute. I think it's cute she is for now. Also, I might give a lavender real quick. 
um, just really fast. I might go ahead and give her a new hot weather wear look. Um, because these are all, like, kind of old. Like, she's been wearing them for a while. Um, and I feel like, you know, girl deserves something new. So, um, I'm gonna give her these work jeans, because they're cute. And then, purple shirts. Um, I mean, she's got a few really cute options. But, honestly, none of them are suiting my, like, lavender taste. I might give her this, though, because it's from the new pack, and I honestly think it's really pretty. Um, so, I'm gonna do that. And I think I'm going to change this shirt to this island living one. And then maybe we'll do some... Okay, not those. Uh, hmm. Maybe some more of these jeans. Or uh. maybe some, like, cropped cute pants. So I'm kind of looking for like a specific vibe here, but I don't want to use like custom content, but those, that kind of is what I'm going for. Like kind of high-waisted stuff, but mm -hmm. uh, I can't find anything that really, that really goes with what I'm looking for. Um, maybe we could just give her a uh -huh. white skirt and... A little bit of a longer lavender shirt. Uh, I don't really like that one. It's not quite lavender enough. But neither is that one really. Having a hard time. I'm not gonna lie. Having a very hard time. Ah. But I wanted to give her a couple like more momish type looks. Um, just to give her like a little bit of a you know, makeover, because I don't really want to give her too much of one when she ages up to being an adult. Um, so I just thought maybe I'd give her one now. Uh, hmm. I kind of yeah. don't really like any of these. Because, like, see, what I want is something like that. You know, like, it looks summery and it's cute, but it's CC. Because all good things are CC. And it's like, I want something that's like cute, like this, maybe a little longer. See, like that. Like this denim skirt. That would be really cute. Um, also, this would be really cute. Um, maybe even this. This would be really cute. I might. Could I give her the skirt? <laughs> like, I know it's CC, but if I break from. If I just give her the one CC skirt, then I'm not using CC on any of her other looks, right? So, surely I can, I can, I can change just a little bit on this one, right? Right. I mean, one, one kind of CC look isn't gonna, it isn't gonna, like, compromise the game, you know? It's not compromising anything. No, I just gotta find the top that goes with it. Cause see, the bottom doesn't really have mm. any purple in it. It's kind of just cute. Uh, but the problem is, I need something purple. Um, but it doesn't really have purple, and I, you know, it's okay. Oh, this is kind of purple. No, no, I really shouldn't. It's purple. I shouldn't. But it's purple. Okay, this is... A I really shouldn't. I shouldn't. I shouldn't be bringing CC into this. Mm. But you know what? I think I might be. I think I might be. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna do that. And then, did I get for any other looks here? Uh, these are fairly new, so we'll keep those the same. And honestly, I think I might be ending this episode fairly soon. Um, because after this is mostly just going to be skill building. 
Um, because, yeah, we're gonna do some tummy time with Sherry here. Because she's gotta get her, her, like, her skills going on. And, yeah. I gotta figure out what to do about Chelsea. Are you still dazed? Four hours? You're gonna end up going to work. Okay, look, you're just work on the book. <laughs> okay. And if you get burnt out, you get burnt out, you know, but that's not my problem. Um, let's see. Uh, okay. Is she gonna reach a milestone? Maybe look at the toys. I want her to get like a milestone. Um, on camera. She did get two quirks while she was sleeping overnight. Uh, maybe tell some jokes. Um, so let's go ahead and look at those real quick. So, she got the gassy quirk. This infant has tummy issues. Infants with this quirk work will be gassier and fussier, which was sensitive. It's just bad. Hey, it's wake up time. This infant rarely, rarely wakes up in a good mood. Infants with this quirk are more likely to behave like grumpy bunnies when they wake up from nap or sleep. So pair that with the sensitive thing, and yeah, she's just kind of a really grumpy baby. Um, why do you quit working on your book? Please resume working on that. I she's almost done, I think. Um, so yeah, she's just gonna work on her skills, and the baby's okay. Oh, she's a little upset. Okay, please stop. Okay, uh, use the diaper. And your mom will, uh, mom will change your diaper, okay? And then put Cherry to bed, play a lullaby. Come on. What? What are you doing? Girl, what? Why did she do that? How are you doing? You doing okay? Okay, good. Okay, you're loving four writing. Okay. Good for you. Also, I'm not sure if I showed you guys this episode. Uh, but this is her nursery. It's really cute. Um... I personally really love it. It's really soft lavender colors because, you know, she designed it and, you know, she ain't about to put maroon in her baby's nursery. Like, why would she? Uh, I probably will when we know it's maroon June for sure. Yeah, I will see you guys in the next one. So if you guys enjoyed, then please do a like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Bye-bye!